What's up everybody, Chlorine King here. Thanks for tuning in for another video. I got something really exciting and really cool to share with you regarding skimmer and a workaround that we found that's been extremely helpful to streamline things and make things more efficient and have a cyclical line of communication between the technician, the office, the client, then the office back to the technician. So what do I mean by that? One of the cool things that I love about Skimmer is the alert office feature. So for those who aren't familiar, basically when a technician's filling out a report while they're out of pool servicing it, there's a note section where you can alert the office with whatever the technician finds, like a broken skimmer basket or a leaking pump o-ring or, or whatever the case may be, they can alert that um, and send that information to the office. Then the office calls the client and gets the uh, approval for whatever needs to be done. The problem is there's no way the software right now allows the communication to go back to the tech to keep the tech what's, to let the tech know what's going on. There's been some times where techs call, hey, you know, I reported this uh, two weeks ago. What's the status of it? And, you know, the clients out in Europe backpacking or whatever. And so there's a lot of phone calls being made back and forth for a simple skimmer basket or something, tying up a lot of time. So our workaround for this is creating a office alert follow-up work order. So that way when uh, the technician reports, hey, the skimmer basket's broken, we need to get it replaced, Tiffany in our office calls out to the client, gets the approval, and then from there, she'll uh, apply for the following week uh, office alert follow-up work order underneath the client's name. So technically there'll be two stops for the uh, client. Uh, giving information to the technician as far as what transpired, what needs to be done and all that fun stuff. And then if they do approve it, there'll be a third stop for the client, another work order for tech installation with a B9 skimmer basket. Uh, so it's a great workaround to make sure that everybody's aware of what's going on because the technician is the one out in the field. They need to know what's going on, if they need to replace a skimmer basket and whatnot. And right now, all that skimmer allows us to do is communicate with the office, but no real way to communicate back to the technician as far as the results of their alert office. So by creating an office alert work order or follow up work order, that allows us to connect that circle to allow that cyclical line of communication, cyclical line of communication, that's funny, cyclical communication from technician to office to client to office to technician. So. That way everything runs smoother throughout the day. So create that office alert, follow up work order, and see how much easier uh, your techs um, get through their day and eliminate unnecessary and plentiful phone calls for the office or you if you're running the office for lack of better words and just see how much that goes away. So I hope you guys enjoy that workaround. Stay tuned for more videos, like and subscribe, and we'll see you next video. Have a great day.